Hi, welcome to class. Today we're going to do a five minute routine with a Pilates ball to work our abs and our glutes. So let's begin lying onto our backs on the mat. And just close your eyes and take a few nice big breaths here. Just relaxing on the exhale. Big expansive inhale. And relax on the exhale. I'm going to take hold of your ball and raise your arms up to the ceiling. And you're going to press your hands into it a little as you take your arms overhead and then return them. So you're gently pressing into the ball and thinking about keeping the back of the shoulders anchored down like they have weights in them. And we'll do two more like this. And then keeping your arms up now we're going to lift and lower the hips. So squeezing the bottom muscles on as you lift and lower. Nice and controlled and at the same time gently squeezing the ball. And the next time we lift the hips let's keep them up and then we're taking both arms overhead. For five, four, three, two, one, keep the arms up to the ceiling and we're going to lift and lower the hips again for five, four, three, two, one, keeping them up as you do the same movement with the arms for five, four, three, two, one and lower the hips and see if you can keep the ball uh, between your arms or between your hands uh, and if that's too challenging you can do this next sequence with the arms down by your sides. So you can lift one leg to tabletop and then we're going to lift and lower the hips for five, four, three, two, one and switch legs five, four, three, two, one. Keep the hips up and just alternate legs here, lifting and lowering alternating legs, doing your best to keep your pelvis really still. Just moving the legs. Two more each leg. Good, and then we're going to keep the hips up. This time bring your feet all the way together, squeeze your knees together, lift your heels, and we're going to do little pulses up with the hips for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good work everybody, lower your hips down. We're going to rock up to a seated position and put the ball behind your back now to do some upper back stretches and ab work. So interlace your fingers, hands behind your head and stretch back to the mat. And you can allow your head to go right back to the mat here and let's open the elbows and close them a few times just to open up the shoulders and stretch out a little. And then bringing the elbows back to a neutral position. Now I've got my knees bent, I've got my feet flat on the mat, I've got my knees all the way together so they're squeezing a little and I'm thinking about lengthening the back of my waistband down into the mat as I curl my head and shoulders forward. I'm going to almost lift off the ball but not quite and then I'm going to stretch back again. So again we lift and stretch back. And let's do two more like this. Good work and then we're going to extend both legs out straight on the mat squeezing them together and we're going to repeat do another six here like this. Five, 
So thinking of keeping the back of your waistband down as best you can. And two more. Good, and then I'm gonna bring both legs up to tabletop, squeeze the knees together, lengthen the back of the waist down and repeat. Let's do another six here. And on the last one, can you hold? And just alternating toe taps, five each side. Two, three, four, five. Well done, come up to sitting. And that's it, a quick five minute workout with the ball. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please check out some of my other videos. And I hope to see you again soon. Thanks so much, bye for now.